Hey, good morning. Uh, Trent Harris with Master Medical Equipment. Today we're going to discuss the uh, Tempest ALS solution. Uh, the Tempest ALS solution uh, is comprised of two different units, the Tempest Pro and the Tempest LS. So just a quick overview and a 360 of the Tempest Pro unit. On the face, like we mentioned earlier, it's a full functioning touch screen. Any parameter, you can just touch into that area of the monitor and make any adjustments or modifications that you need to. Um, this unit also uh, pushes everything to a cloud-based system called Corsium. That's what really sets it apart from all the other units in the, in the market. Uh, Corsium is a cloud-based uh, system where the physician in the emergency room is looking at a live, real-time view of every parameter on the monitor. You're not just pushing a button and transmitting a 12 lead to an email. They're actually looking at this, every bit of data from this patient, and can make clinical decisions uh, based on what they see. And when they make those decisions, they can in turn send orders, um, make recommendations, and transmit data back to the ambulance. On this side, got just a few different ports. There is a uh, switch here that can kill all communication um, if you're in the tactical environment. There are USB ports, data ports. This unit has the capability to add a plug and play video laryngoscope, plug and play ultrasound via the USB ports. On the back, you will see an integrated 3.2 megapixel camera that you can push images through Corsium, real-time view um, by the physician and the ED if needed. ECG port, NIBP, this is an optional uh, IBP uh, module. You can uh, monitor up to four invasive lines with this unit. And then your capnography line. Now there's nothing on the screen because I don't have it hooked up to a simulator. The LS does have a 5.2 inch um, color screen. It is not a touch screen. All of your buttons are manual buttons located around the face of the unit. It is paired to the Pro via Bluetooth and when they, when they recognize each other or within range, you will hear an audible and see a visual indication of that. This is your standard. It's where you would select your energy. If you're delivering therapy, charge button and the shock button. These are used to set your different rates uh, or your energy. Three lead ECG port. And then on this unit, there's not a trunk cable uh, for delivering therapy. You know, the six foot cable from your pads actually plugs directly into the unit uh, via this blue port here. And this is your charging, uh, charging port and some USB ports. The battery is located on the bottom of the unit. It does have a battery indicator and a kickstand. I mean, it's pretty simple. <laughs> 